Right, okay. But the song was based on a real situation, correct? I mean, yes. Yeah, yeah, yes and no. Don't don't really talk about that too much. Yes and no. I mean, documentation would say that you had a girlfriend who passed away in a car accident. Is that factually true? No, it's not. It's not. Uh, well, I, I, what the hell? I'll tell the story, I guess. Uh, <laughs> I was with my wife on a Sunday, and we had gone to dinner, and we were going to um, Baskin Robbins for our after dinner, whatever, ice cream and drive home. And this is, you know, just on Huntington Beach where we live. And so we're waiting in line, and there's 10 people in the store. A couple runs in. They, they go, call the police. Someone's chasing us with a gun. And we're like, what the hell? What's going on? <clears throat> All of a sudden, shots rang out. So the, these these people in this, in this car, they had been chased by gang, 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 gang members in another car who were mad at them for some reason. They ran into the store. These guys decided to shoot up the store. So, I mean, they... It looks like they shot high. I don't think they actually intended to kill anybody. But anyway, all of a sudden, here we are. And it's one of those, like, strip malls where it's it's a complete glass, you know, front to the store shooting it. And uh, all of a sudden, it's like, well, fuck, I'm, we're going to die, right? <laughs> and, <laughs> you know, in hiding, trying to, you know, get behind a trash can or something, not even knowing where the bullets are coming from. And it turns out I was right in front of the gunman or whatever. But, you know, and then crawling over to my wife and, you know, putting my body on top of hers and just knowing like, I'm going to get shot any second here, I'm going to get shot. And, you know, there were several shots that rang out. The whole front was, was, was what, you know, was shot out. And uh, luckily no one was hurt. So I think they just wanted to have fun and scare everybody. Right. I don't think they're really trying to kill anybody, but I think just the, the, I, the idea that we came so close to death was a real life changing moment. And it was right when we were recording Ixnay and uh, I, I was coming up with the I, the idea, I knew I wanted the song to be heavy, but I didn't know what it was going to be about yet. But it was kind of like the feeling of, in, in, a, in a weird way, I know it's not a direct connection, if you know what I mean, but it made you think about, you know, about dying and about grief and about what that would feel like. And, and what if what if my wife had been the one? Okay, so the incident happens. How long after that do you write the song, and does it come to you in a flash, or something takes a long time to work out? Oh, I wrote it in the next week. It was quick. Yeah, it was it was done in a few days. And the lyrics? How long did it take you to write the lyrics? A few days. Yeah, quick, okay. quick for me. Quick for you. 